And uh, cannabis, uh, as cannabis enthusiasts rather around the world are celebrating marijuana, this 420, where it's legal. Uh, not everyone is feeling so festive, with a number of legal marijuana growers saying their industry is now under financial stress. Fox's Ted Lindner tonight taking a closer look. The future of the legal marijuana industry is looking murky, especially for growers out west. I don't know any companies that are really making money. Temperate weather along the west coast provides the perfect growing conditions for the plants. The problem? Even though 21 states have legalized recreational pot for adults, federal law bans the interstate sale of marijuana, leaving many farmers in California, Oregon, Washington State, and Colorado with too much supply and not enough demand. Everybody's just trying to manage their losses. And the most successful companies tend to be the ones that were able to raise the most capital and survive the longest downturn. The oversupply is causing growers and cannabis shops to slash prices. It's good for consumers, but bad for business. With the legal marijuana industry already having to compete for profits with illegal sellers nationwide. The illicit market is booming. There's more money to be made there. And, you know, ultimately those are our biggest competitors right now. To combat the surging stock of pot and boost declining revenues, Growers are hoping the federal government will approve marijuana trade throughout states where it's legal. Many are surprised it's taken this long. I don't know if I would have, you know, really been all in or, or done this, really, if I would have known it was going to take this long for federal legalization to happen. Ted Lindner, Fox News.